Welcome to our series on Executive Summary, All You Need to Know, Video 2. My name is Bumi Turkong. In this particular video, I'm going to show you the different Executive Summary formats that you can use. Actually, if you look at the bottom of this video, you should find a link to a website that gives you 21 different Executive Summary formats. But the follow-on for this video, I'm going to actually show you the two formats that I've used. One is an old format that I've used and I've used to write, I don't know, about 40 to 50 different business plans that I've actually got money. And the new executive summary format for the lean business plan. I'm doing a new business plan called the lean business plan. And I'm going to show you the executive summary format that I'm going to use. So, all that to look forward to. So let's dive on and look at two examples right now that you can find of executive summaries. In this particular example, it's from Coverage Challenge, Creating Scotland's Entrepreneurs, and it gives us what the executive summary right here should cover. It talks about the mission of the company, the purpose, its uniqueness and selling points, then summary of the market opportunity, summary of key aspects of the company and then the summary of the vision of the company it's quite a small executive summary uh type of template we're looking at here the rest is about the business plan talks about the company the product and, and stuff but we are concerned about the headings of the executive summary so let's go on to look at another example this example is a much more elaborate type of executive summary. It covers the owners, the authors, the addresses, the phone number. Um, then it looks at what sector you are in, what products or services do you provide, what's your target audience, what does the future of your industry look like, it goes on. Then it talks about the experience you have in this particular sector, why now. Um, next it summarizes the ask, what you're asking for, how much money are you asking for? How are you going to use that money? And then it ends with how it will make your business profitable, which essentially gets into how and when you'll pay it back. So those two, I showed you uh, the first executive summary was quite a small summary. And this one is a much more elaborate type of executive summary, which has a lot more detail than the first one. So in the follow on video to this, I'm going to actually show you the two executive summaries that I use. All right. So if you like this video, then like it. If you like it, comment about it. If you have any question at all about executive summaries, then let me know because this is part of the videos that I want to do for you so that you can write very good executive summaries. If you do have a question, then do let me know. Otherwise, I'll see you in the next lecture. Talk to you soon.